All right, here we are in the next installment of the New York Jets Rebuild franchise. As promised, here is the Super Bowl, the Green Bay Packers in overtime, beating the Jacksonville Jaguars here. It was a 7-6 game at halftime in favor of the Jaguars. After three quarters, it was 12-10 Green Bay. And a 9-7 fourth quarter allowed Jacksonville to go to overtime with Green Bay, but they would get the touchdown in overtime. Aaron Rodgers, two touchdowns and a pick. Bortles, one touchdown, one pick. Montgomery again with a 100-yard day and a touchdown. There's Fournette with 80 and a touchdown. Receiving Jordy Nelson and Allen Robinson with touchdowns today. Looking at the defensive side of things, two sacks for Nagukwe, one for Perry, one for Daniels, the defensive player of the year. A couple interceptions, one for each team. So there you have it, Green Bay Packers, Super Bowl champions. All right, let's upgrade some of our guys here. Marcus May, we know he made the Pro Bowl, so we're going to get him upgraded he has got 21,000 points, which is pretty freaking good. So we're going to go ahead. We're going to get him to a quick, and we're going to move some of his skills up so that we can make him a better safety for next year so we don't really have to go out and draft one. He's a 78 overall quick now. It's 179 overall quick at 25 years old, so I'm quite happy with him. Tariq Cohen was only a 71 overall. I tried to get him to a superstar, the game being... As stupid as it is, wouldn't even let me get him to a quick. So I have no idea what's going on with this game. I hate it. Please patch this. Please, EA, what the fuck? So let's go after some of the stuff as far that he could probably use. Maybe a little bit more catching. Uh, maybe some stiff arm. Yeah, because I use that enough. And some carrying. I don't want him fumbling. And then a bunch of awareness. So we'll see what we can get him to. He's a 76 overall. Not bad. Now we have Locke Edwards, our fantastic punter. So we want to make him good as well. I didn't really want to give him any kind of traits or anything. So I figured I would throw him. Never mind the power. I just throw him a ton of accuracy and a ton of awareness. That's really what I want to give him. That way he doesn't get pump blocked. Hopefully. Anymore. All right, that'll take him to an 81 from a 69, so that's pretty fucking awesome. Now we got Chandler Catanzaro. Chandler Catanzaro, another great player for us this year. I made him clutch, so he can make some clutch kicks. Get his accuracy way up there and a little bit of awareness. Oh, couldn't do that, so I had to take a little bit back, but whatever. Jamal Adams is next. Jamal Adams, I want to make him clutch. I want him to be one of those kind of guys that just gets the job done when you need him to. I want to have him strip the ball so he can make some plays out there. And I want to get him some probably maybe a little bit more... Tackling, what do we want to give? What do we want to give Jamal Adams? Here, let's give him a little pursuit. Let's give him some awareness. He's got to be able to get the job done back there. So he'll be an 83 overall. So I'm liking the safeties. Robbie Anderson at 76 overall. I had to go ahead and up his development trait. And then we're going to give him some slight improvements here. That'll get him to a 78. Our number one receiver possibly. Potentially. So we will look at the re-sign period as the rest of the guys were just auto-upgraded. So not a big deal because they didn't really have a ton of points. Michael Burton at an 88. He's a good fullback. Uh, he's a good impact blocker. He didn't really, we didn't really use him a ton. But if we can get him for like really cheap, I'll take him. Let's see. What's fair? About 1.8 million. I'll give him that for four years. No bonus. We can cut him whenever we want. Ooh, he'll take it. Perfect. I'll take that. Uh, Perry Riley, I want to deal with him a little bit later. I don't know if I want to get him or not. I'm not going to re-sign a Nunwa. I'm just not going to do it. Desmond Bryant, we will try to bring back on a kind of cheap deal. He had a decent season for us. He only went down one point from old age here. Three million dollars for two years. I'll try it. It's He likes it. If we need to, we can always try and move him if somebody's interested in him. Perry Riley. I'm still mulling that one. 
Morris Claiborne deserves a deal with us. Uh, I don't really want to give him a ton of money, though. I don't. I'm not really much of a paying person. But I'll give him three million, no bonus. Oh, he wants to play for a new team. All right, we'll see what, what you get in free agency, man. Safarian Jenkins, I, he got hurt again. The guy is always hurt. He's a slow development player, but damn, is he fast. And damn, can he help us in the receiving game. I mean, he's terrible for a blocking tight end. And he doesn't want to sign. Whatever. All right, Mike Pennell is another guy signed in the free agents last year, I think. Maybe I did, maybe I didn't. I don't know. I know Desmond Bryant I did, so we're bringing Desmond Bryant back. Can we bring Mike Pennell back? Will Pennell take this deal? Nah, he wants to go to free agents. All right, let him go. Catanzaro, we need you, man. You were huge for us. 27 years of age. He's got plenty of kicking life left in him. Let's try and lock him up. Nah, he's not interested. Alright, whatever. We'll see in free agency. We'll probably try and go after him there. Tariq Cohen now at a 76 overall. Quick. I very much like him. I'd love to lock him up long term. I don't really want to pay him that much though. Like He deserves a little bit of a signing bonus though. Like I'll give him a tiny one. There you go. That's like 1.8 million total. He'll take it. Fine. We'll keep you, Tariq. Caleb Brantley. This is a guy that really didn't get too much on the field, but I think he's got some potential possibly. So let's see if we can lock him up long term. That's $2 million a year for five years. He'll take it. All right, fine. Demario Davis. Uh, this is a guy who made some plays out there. He's getting a little older, though. Maybe it is time to sell high. Uh, that's probably maybe the time to do it let's see oh he wants to go to free agency okay wesley johnson your turn you didn't even really play that much this year so don't be giving me a hard time with money because you're not really have earned it but let's try and bring him in 1.2 for four years not interested okay bye have a lovely day jonathan harrison he played okay for us only gave up one sack all season We'll try and bring him back. Eh, he wants free agency. Fine. Go. What else we got? Colin, we're not bringing you back. All right. Chris Gregg. That's kind of a guy I'd like to have back. I know he's not amazing, but damn, he's pretty quick. You know what I mean? So if we couldn't have Safarian Jenkins, maybe we can have Chris, Chris Gregg. Let's just see if he will come back for a really cheap deal here under a million. Nope, he wants to go to free agency. All right, let him go. Marcus Williams, he made some plays out there, and we're going to need some corners. I know he's not the greatest. He's not the fastest. He doesn't even really man cover very well at all. Technically should be playing safety, but let's just see if he'll take a $1.5 million. No, he wants to test free agency. All right, bye, Marcus. Deshaun Hall, a guy I stole off of practice squad. I'd really like to bring him back. He did pretty well in his short time playing time that he got. All right, good. He'll come back. I'll take him. Lucky Whitehead. It wasn't amazing as a receiver. He's a pretty good kick returner. Wasn't that great of a punt returner for us, but let's see if we can get him for really cheap here. He wants to go to free agency. All right, bye, boy. Rontez Miles, I do not want back. Deion Simon, I do not want back. Cameron Sutton, I do want it's another guy I took off of a practice squad. I would really like to bring him back. I don't want to pay him, though. Seven years? Yes, signed forever for no bonus. I'll take it. I'm not bringing Still or him back or Thomas back or Johnson. I'm not bringing any of those guys back. All right, so let's take one final look here at what is left, which is basically Perry Riley and Quincy Anunua, which I don't think I want to bring Anunua back. I'm going to try Perry Riley, but I'm going to try what I did with Desmond Bryant. And I know he might say no, but that's fine. Let's just see. Oh, maybe we're going to give him a little bit of a bonus, probably. Eh, maybe, maybe not. Let's see. What can we give him? 350K? Three years, uh, two years. All right, he's coming back to the squad. That's fine. All right, these are the list of free agents that we are putting offers in on. Drew Brees was available, didn't really want to go there. 
Uh, we'll put an offer on Jay Cutler. Nobody's going after him. I'm not paying any of these guys. So here is, after one week of free agency, what it is looking like we might be able to bring in here. All right. Looking pretty good. McKinnon, I wish I could get him. It uh, doesn't look like I'm going to be able to. It doesn't look like I'm going to get Ely or Will Ty, who I really wanted to bring in. So we're going to have to go ahead and take a look at some a different back I could bring in to go with Tariq Cohen and Elijah McGuire. So I was looking at Lacey. I don't really like Lacey's you know, style. Not really my kind of running back. Gillisley, I'm not really a big fan of either, but... Looking at Jacquees Rogers, 85 speed for a speed back is terrible. I do like Charkandrick West, so let's try and bring in Charkandrick West to the squad on a really, really cheap deal, even though it doesn't look it. I'm sorry. That was my mistake. That's 16.6. All right, let's get rid of that. All right, so we're going to try and bring in Charkandrick West on a cheap, cheap, cheap deal. Three years, four years. 950,000. We'll see if uh, he can be our back instead then. And then we're going to have to look at tight end. So I'm going to try and go ahead and see if we can grab Zach Miller. Zach Miller, the six foot five, huge target. He's fast enough. Catches 91. I mean, he'd be a guy I'd bring in. We'll try 2 million for two years. And somebody instantly goes after him. Unbelievable. Doesn't look like we'll get Dre Kirkpatrick or Justin Coleman, so we'll be out of a couple corners we were going after. I'm going to have to put Austin Safarian Jenkins on the list now. Nobody's going after him, as we're probably not going to get Ty or Miller, so we need some kind of tight end up in here. So let's try and go for ASJ. Throw him a little something. So we got Newman still on there. All right, we're looking over at who got what. There's Drew Brees going to the Bills, Bridgewater to the Saints. These are not guys I wanted to bring in. I want to draft my own quarterback. Hill going to the Bucks. LeGarrette Blunt going to the Bucks. So Blunt and Hill, the two of the top three running backs, are both going to Tampa Bay. Very interesting. Burkhead back to the Patriots. Looking at the fullbacks now. Now you got Lee. Josh Gordon to the Chiefs. Interesting choice. Just looking at some of the places these guys are going. Cameron Brait was on there. Will Ty's going to the Jags. So yeah, he's not coming here. A lot of the linemen that I would have wanted to go for just um, either weren't going to come here or they were getting paid way too much for what they were. A lot of these guys were older, and I'm not going to, I'm not, I wasn't going to pay the money. I just wasn't going to do it. Let's see. Williams, Kyle Williams was out there. We don't really need any D tackles. I think we'll be fine there. Looking at some of the D tackles here that have gone. There's some right ends. Easily, Curry. Shaq Barrett to the Bills. Bills have spent some money. They will be playing us with Drew Brees and Shaq Barrett next year. For a team that was already 11 and 5. Will they improve or not? That's that's going to be the question mark there. As we're coming down to the end of this, guys, thank you for watching. If you did enjoy this, please go ahead and hit the like button. The next video put out will be the draft video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Again, if you're new, don't forget to hit subscribe. You only miss one season. You can always go back and watch it. The new season will be coming very, very shortly. Thank you guys again, and I'll see you all next time. Thank you.